When we go in, we talk to the patients, we talk to the families, we introduce ourselves. How much you explain to them what your job position is and the kind of care, the care you're going to provide for them. And you also introduce yourself to the families and you let them know that if, while they're here, you intend to give their mom, a dad, a brother, sister, whoever, the best care that you can provide for them. Trust is actually very important in my book, uh, not only for my team, it is also for the patients. Um, developing that trust, developing that relationship from patient to not only the clinician that they're used to seeing every day, but as well as every so often we say hello and introduce ourselves, my name is, is everything going okay? They develop that trust that is necessary for them to get better. I'm not here 24 hours a day, so I have to depend on the staff to, you know, and trust that they're going to do it and make the decisions that need to be made to protect the patient. Keep them open and honest. You know, they realize that they're not always going to have the best ideas just because they're the leader, that, you know, everyone's got something to add to this. Well, it's important to know that, um, you know, you stand side by side with someone and every day you come to work and that you know that they'll take care of you and you'll take care of them and that you continue the care no matter what decisions you make they're going to continue to make the same decisions we treat their family member their loved one the best we can it helps them you know it gives them a peace of mind so when they're not here um, they just know that their loved one's being taken care of and they can trust us and it's very important to have trust teamwork and trust is everything if I know I can go to lunch and I have a nurse that's watching my patients, she has my back and she's not just protecting me but my patients. Teamwork. You have to, I mean, to work in a setting like this, you have to have teamwork or it's not going to work. One of our key cultural behaviors is this whole notion of building trust. And what that really means is that where there's social media, where there's Twitter, where there's Facebook, that you're going to have the opportunity. Um, we trust the fact that you're going to be able to communicate these inspiring messages and do it the right way. And to me, that's what this is all about, is the trust we have for our employees, the trust that you have in the company, and the trust that you have with your patients that you're going to do the right thing for them.